Hello YouTube and welcome to another Linux tutorial. So today I'm going to show you how you can monitor your system processes using the htop command. So already let's get started. So usually when you want to actually see the processes in your system, all you have to do is to execute the command top as you can see here. So it's better to launch it using the root privileges as you can see now. This is the top command and with this command you can see how much CPU, how much memory all the processes are taken from your system. Okay. But as you can see here, this is not really graphical, not color. You cannot do too much of it. So in order to solve this problem, there is a new command called htop. Actually htop is the graphical user interface for top. So of course if, you, if it's not installed, you can install it using the apt-gate, install and htop. Okay. So me, I already done that, so the application is installed. So in order to launch it, always with root privileges, you just type htop. As you can see now, I have uh, here a graphical interface and also a call for. At the top you can see how much uh, memory, how much swap it's taken for my system. Here I have a dual core processor, so you can see each one how much is taken for my system and just in the middle you can find all the processes that are running in your system so there are some really good shortcut for example you can use your up and down key to select a process as you can see here you can kill it using the f9 command just at the bottom you can also change the priority of the command or of the process using the F7 or F8 shortcut in your keyboard as you can see here in the bottom you can always do sort so here for example I'm sorting by memory but I can choose the sort by criteria so I will press F6 and here you can choose whatever sort by you want for example let's sort by uh, percent of the CPU okay so here as you can see just at the top simple screen recorder which, I, which I'm using for recording this video is taking a lot of CPU time okay so you can always press F6 and change another criteria for the state or size or the user who is using the process. And of course if you want to quit you have just to type as you can see here F10. Okay. So that was just a quick video to show you how you can use this really interesting program called HTOP. As always, I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing. Bye bye.